Hello and welcome back to the next episode of our Oblivion Let's Play series. In the last episode, we went into Man Car Cameron's Paradise and defeated him. And now we need to take Martin into the High Council and present him so he can uh, put in his claim for Emperor of uh, Cyrodiil. Uh, let's see, I think we need to just go in, in here, welcome yeah. To the Imperial Palace. Oh, thank you. Where is Martin? I was told that he had arrived in the capital. Uh, is he not with me? Hey, Martin. Welcome what are you doing, dude? Imperial Where did Palace. you go? Well, he was right with me. Come on, Martin. Hurry up. Chop, chop. Time's a wasting. <laughs> Silly guy. Get in there. There we go. Get gravy. Welcome to the oh, thank you again. Where is Martin? Oh, good gravy. All right. Come on, dude. There we go. We have arrived in the Elder Council Chamber. I must formally present Martin's claim to Chancellor Akato, the head of the Elder Council. I've been expecting you. The full council has already considered the matter of Martin's claim to the Imperial Throne in detail. Okay, and? Martin Septim, on behalf of the Elder Council, Chancellor I accept Okado. your claim to the Imperial Chancellor Throne. Chancellor Okado! Chancellor Okado! The city is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened and Daedra are inside the walls. Well, that's not good. Is overwhelmed. Courage, soldier. We have an emperor again. Your Highness, what are your orders? Shall the guard fall back to the palace? No. If we let ourselves get besieged in the palace, we're doomed. We must get to the Temple of the One immediately. As you command, sire. Guards, form up and protect the emperor. To the Temple of the One. The Imperial City is under attack. Oblivion gates have opened all over the city and danger are pouring out. I must escort Martin safely to the Temple of the One where he can light the dragon fires, close the oblivion gates, and save the city. All right, come on, Martin. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, <laughs> they are just here. Great, there we go. Let's see if we can get rid of some of these guys. Whoa, dude. Holy crud. Dude, that was rude. Ooh, you have nothing on you? Cool. But I will take those arrows back. Come on, guys, let's get out of here. Before even more show up. Over this way. Whoa, jeez Louise. Man, there are a lot of them. Holy crud. We got everything here, don't we? Yow, dude. My willpower. Leave my willpower alone. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to get you there, dude. Apparently we have to fight our way through this. Good gravy. Whoa, whoa. No, no, no. <laughs> no, why are you coming after me? I am not the biggest threat here, people. Uh, you. <laughs> Die. Kid, gravy. Oh, I think I just killed a guard. Well, that's never a good luck. Hopefully they don't get... Yeah, I know. Would you guys quit fighting long enough to, to get there? Holy crud. These guys are getting racked. Come on. There you go. Come on, Martin. Quit fighting. Good night. Ooh, poor Captain Stefan. He didn't make it. At least there wasn't an elven arrow in him. <laughs> I didn't do it. Dang it, I didn't. I swear to Bob's I didn't. Alright, come on, Martin. Yep, there we go. You go through first. Come on. There you go, buddy. Ah, the Temple of the One. Yes, let's get in there and do the thing. Whoa. Okay. Do we really need to fight everything? Ouch. Oh, hey, dude. Whoa. Okay. There's too many people here. Holy crud. The Mayroon's Dagon is here. The barriers between Oblivion and Tamriel have been destroyed. Our only hope now is to somehow defeat Mayroon's Dagon and claim and cast him back into Oblivion. Perhaps Martin will know what to do. All right, well, Martin, you want to, well, help me here? Oh, jeez, I am stuck in a corner. Holy crud. My health is almost gone. I just happened to take a look at that. 
not good. Let's go over to our potions. Let's suck down a couple of them. Good gravy. We're too late. Mayroon's Dagon is here. It looks like it. Lighting the dragon fires will no longer save us. The barriers that protected us from oblivion are gone. Can we cast him back into oblivion? I don't see how. Mortal weapons may hurt him, but now that he is physically here in Tamriel, they have no power to actually destroy him. What about the Amulet of Kings? Wait, yes. The amulet was given to mortals by Akatosh. It contains his divine power. But how to use this power against Dagon? The amulet was not intended as a weapon. I have an idea, one last hope. I must reach the Dragonfires and the Temple of the One. But you said it was no use. You'll just have to trust me. I know now what I was born to do, but I'll need your help. I have to get past Mehrun's Dagon somehow. I'll get you to the temple. Then I'll do the rest. Lead on, my friend. Absolutely. Follow me, then. I'm with you. Okay. Uh, watch out, dude. Come on. You need to ouch die. Thank you. Come on. Let's get out of Whoa, what am I stuck on? Jeez, dude. I am stuck on this jerk. Okay, get me out of there. Holy crud. Forget all you people. Come on, Martin. Martin, please tell me you're with me. Yes, you are. All right, let's get inside here. Whoa. That's something you don't see every day. Excuse me, Mr. Mayroon's Dagon. Let's go into the Temple of the One. Holy crud. All right, Martin, do your thing, buddy. Martin and I are inside the Temple of the One. I must get Martin to the Dragon Fires or all hope is lost. Well, I think we're pretty good. Uh, it should be right here. Come on, Martin. What are you doing? I do what I must do. I cannot stay to rebuild Tamriel. That task falls to others. Farewell. You've been a good friend in the short time that I've known you. But now I must go. The dragon waits. Okay. And holy crud. There's Mayroon's Dagon. And there goes Martin doing his amulet thing. Lots of poofy smoke, bubbles, fire. Wow. Whoa. Martin's a dragon. Well, it makes sense. It does make sense. Whoa. He just flew right through him. Holy crud. That's a battle, isn't it? Ouch. That was a bad hit. Come on, Martin. Strike back. Don't let him win. You got this, buddy. That's right. Use your fire. Ooh, yeah, choke him. Ooh, no, you bit him in the neck. Good for you. Don't just stomp your foot. Get in there and there you go. The poofy fire. I think you got some coming out of your belly button, or somebody did. Did you just absorb Mayroon's Dagon? Holy crud. You look pretty tired, dude. You gonna be okay. Yeah, he seems pretty triumphant. And just like that, Martin is gone and turned into a statue. The is shattered. Dagon is defeated. With the dragon's blood and the amulet of kings, we have sealed the gates of oblivion forever. The last of the septims passes now into history. I go gladly, for I know my sacrifice is not in vain. I take my place with my father and my father's fathers. The third age has ended and a new age dawns. When the next Elder Scroll is written, you shall be its scribe. The shape of the future, the fate of the Empire. These things now belong to you. Wow. What happened? Where's Martin? I must congratulate him. Mayroon's Dagon is defeated. Cast back into oblivion. We've won! Uh, Martin's gone, dude. What do you mean, gone? We saw the temple dome explode. The avatar of Akatosh appear. That was Martin? That was Martin. Yes, he shattered the amulet. 
the joined blood of kings and gods, the amulet of kings, the divine power of Akatosh. Well, don't forget Martin's blood also. Then Martin is gone. But the gates are sealed. Yes, sealed forever. Merun's Dagon and his ilk can never threaten Tamriel again. Martin is dead, but he died an emperor and a hero to rival Tiber Septim. What about the Empire? This victory is not without cost. We've lost Martin Septim. What an emperor he might have made. His sacrifice was necessary, but it leaves the Empire without an emperor. I don't know what happens now. There are troubled times ahead for the Empire. But now is not the time to worry about the future. Let's just give thanks that we're alive. Oh, dude, I know your future. You probably should worry, but Champion of Cyrodiil. In my capacity as Lord High Chancellor of the Elder Council, I hereby proclaim you Champion of Cyrodiil. So and formal. As a small token of gratitude for your service to the Empire, I have ordered a suit of Imperial Dragon armor made for you. Very cool. Imperial Dragon armor. Imperial Dragon armor is normally worn only by the Emperor himself, but you deserve no less, Champion. Oh, thank you. And the Elder Council? We are now the stewards of the Empire. We can hold the Empire together in the short term. But to be honest, I don't know what will happen. The provinces have been restive for years, even before the latest crisis. With no legitimate claimant for the dragon throne, troubled times lie ahead. You have no idea. What about Martin? I know he's gone. As the Chancellor of the Elder Council, my concern now is how to choose his successor. That is going to be a problem. You have earned the highest rank possible in the Order of the Dragon, the illustrious Order of Imperial Knights founded by Tiber Septim himself. It is a high honor. Only six other champions have been awarded in the history of the Empire. Well, that does sound like an honor. The dragon will stand forever as a memorial to what you and Martin did for all of Tamriel. Okie dokie. Well, we got out of that relatively unscathed. I mean, we almost went down, but we did pretty dang good, I think. And uh, unfortunately, now this place is a wreck, but they got a cool statue out of it. I mean, what more could they possibly want, right? Let's do a little healing. I think I have to wait a little bit. Before I can go get my dragon armor. Or can I just go pick it up? Yeah, I don't think it's ready yet. It's normally over in the Imperial City Prison, I believe. So let's go in, see if it's ready yet. I can't believe it's over. That giant demon. The dragon. What happened? Have we won? Yeah, you're good, dude. You're good. Trust me, you are good. Uh, can I talk to you? Ma'am. What was it like in the temple at the end? Scary. Did Martin really call down the power of Akatosh he to did. smite Dagon? It was great. Yep. Okay. So, Hello. yeah. I must need to wait to get my armor. Speak. You are just the jailer. So, yeah. Speak. With that, that is going to be the need? end of the main game. We have defeated Mayroon's Dagon, helped Martin overcome everything. We've closed and shut the Oblivion Gates. And now I think it's time for a vacation. I think we've earned it. You know, we did hear a very long time ago about this door. Let's see, where was it? A door in the Nibbin Bay. I think... This place sounds like a great place for a vacation. So look forward to that in the next episode. But for now, yeah, that is going to be it for 
Ledra and I here in the main game of Oblivion. So thank you all so very much for joining me today. I've been Volker. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I hope I see you in the next one.